Hi, it's Tales Vids. In this video, I'm going to show the various ways that you can maximize Windows on a Mac. So by this, I mean applications, uh, find a Windows, that kind of thing. Now, if we just go to this application that I've got open, we've got the three colored dots along the top left hand side here. Now, obviously the red one is to close it. The orange one is to minimize it and the green one, which has got a few different uh, options is it'll either maximize it or it'll fill it to full screen, but full screen applications, they get put onto the own desktop. So we we'll just click on the green button now and you can see what I mean. Now that has completely filled this screen, but if we go up under the top of the screen, we can see here that it's put it on its own separate desktop. Now, while there might be times where that's okay, you might want to stop on the same desktop that you were currently on. So if I just go back into that now and take it back out of full screen mode, So we've got various options open to us here. We can drag the side to fill the screen, drag the other side, drag the top and drag the bottom. And that's basically filled the screen and we're on the same desktop. As you can see there is what we were on currently. But as you can see, that's a little bit of a hassle, uh, it's a little bit time consuming. So I'll show the various ways that you can do it a little bit quicker and a little bit better. Now, as we used the green button before to fill the screen, we can also use the option key, which is on the keyboard. And uh, I'll insert a little screenshot and you can see exactly what key I'm uh, meaning. So if we press the option key now, and we'll go to the left hand side. If you remember before, when I, I dragged that, it just dragged the left hand side edge. Now, if I press the option key, you can see now that while I drag the left, the right expands as well. So as you can see, it's expanded the left and right and sides of the application. And that's with holding the option key down. Now, if I go to the top of the window and I also hold the option key again and I drag up you can see there now it's dragged it to the top but it's just a little bit short of going to the bottom and now if I keep if I still keep the option key pressed down and I drag the bottom you can see there stretches the top and the bottom and you can also go to the top left top right bottom left and bottom right corners of the application window and we can use the option key there and as you can see there it stretches it in all directions but it is a little bit fiddly to get it to fill the screen so one last option that we can use is if we hold down the option key and this can be done on any one of the four corners of the uh, application window or find a window. And I'll go on to show the find a window uh, next after this. So whichever bottom corner, top corner that you prefer to use. So in this example, I'll just use this bottom left hand side corner. And we can see now that we've got our uh, diagonal arrow shown up. So if I hold down the option key this time and I double click on my trackpad or mouse, depending on what you've got connected to your Mac computer, we can see there it maximizes the screen in one click and it's still on its own desktop that we were on previously. So I'll just quickly show you that again and then you can uh, just try it on your computer and follow it along. So we've got the window there. Uh, it's just a little window. Now, if I go to 
any one of them four corners so this time I'll just go to the bottom right just to show it from a different side hold down the option key double click either on your trackpad or your mouse and you can see there it maximizes it fills the screen but it doesn't put it on its own desktop so that's an application window maximized now if I open a finder window so again it's the same uh, procedure you know you can either drag a corner drag a side drag top left right bottom whatever but if you want to quickly maximize the screen uh, well the window the finder window in this example again hold down the option key double click and that will fill the screen and again it'll keep it on its own desktop so I'll just get a little make the window really small and then you can see it expand into its maximum size again in uh, more detail so again you've got your find a window open you want to maximize it go to any one of the four corners of the window hold down the option key double click and there we go that's it maximized well I hope you found this uh, video useful if you have please give it a thumbs up and also if you subscribe to my youtube channel you'll receive emails when I upload any new videos well thanks for watching goodbye